Hi, my name is Wade Martin. I'm a PGA instructor with the Villages Golf Academy, and today I'm going to give you a little tip about how to find your ideal swing plane. I get a lot of questions about where the swing plane should be, whether it should be inside or more vertical. This little tidbit is going to give you your definitive swing plane, no matter what your body type. So we'll start. I've got two sticks here. I'm going to line the stick that's in on the inside of the seven iron here, and the stick laying on the ground. This is going to represent our target line. So the first portion, we're going to lean the stick up against your hip, get our address position, and as we start the club back, what we're trying to do is keep the stick against your hip until about, say, an 8 or a 9 o'clock position on your backswing. Once you get here, then you're going to hinge your wrist, and the stick is going to follow the target line, and I'll show you here. So once we get set, we put the club right up next to the target line sticks against my hip, I'll take it back, stick staying against my hip, again around the 8 or 9 o'clock I'll start to hinge the wrist and you'll see the stick here following the stick on the ground our target line. As we keep going up the stick will continue to follow kind of an infinite target line. Once we start down we're going to try to get the stick again following the target line until we get at least past the golf ball. At this point the club will release toward the ball naturally. Then we put our hip, our stick against the hip on the through swing, and that'll get us our swing plane. So if you can use this tip to help you with your swing plane, we have lots of other information for you at the Villages Golf Academy, so come see us.